how do I clean this out for recycling? Can you, I don't know, how do you, you can't see inside. Do you ever feel like a weird pang of guilt when you throw stuff away? I just feel really bad, especially when it's something that I'm gonna buy over and over again, like, you know, shampoo bottles, for example. It's hard to give up beauty products and shampoos and hair masks and face masks and all that stuff. And there aren't a ton of really good environmentally friendly alternatives out there, especially if, you know, you don't have perfect skin, you don't have perfect hair. I don't always know what to do with the bottles and containers and things after they're done. And I'll be honest, it's super hard to clean lotion out of a bottle. I don't care who you are, especially when you can't see the dang inside of the bottle. So once my makeup or my shampoo bottles are empty, I just recycle them and... So you do recycle them? Yes. The makeup and stuff, mm -hmm. do you clean those out? No. I throw it away. Same. I, I throw it away. I throw them in the trash, but I feel like that's not the right answer. <laughs> While there aren't a ton of hard facts on cosmetic packaging specifically, over 40% of plastic use is for packaging products, and only 14% of the world's plastic packaging ends up being recycled. According to the EPA, around 25% of landfill waste is made of packaging. Slightly changing your routine to avoid contributing to landfill can have a huge impact. Now hold on because every place is different. So the first thing you need to do is check online with your city or county's recycling program to see what kinds of things they recycle. You can find the recycling number on the bottom of the bottle or container. If you can recycle these products, great. Just make sure you rinse them out first. Put in some water, shake them up, and pour out the excess product. If the bottle has a pump, that part may not be able to be recycled because it usually contains mixed materials. However, double check on your local sanitation website. They may accept these pumps, I don't know. And even if you can't recycle the pump, you can usually recycle the bottle. It's better than nothing. And now we've come to the juicy bits. Cosmetic packaging comes in all shapes and sizes, and is usually made of mixed materials, which means it's harder to find a place that will accept them for recycling. Now, if you can, try to stick to products that have a one or two on the bottom. These are more likely to be recyclable. But again, check your local rules to make sure. Now, when recycling makeup containers, make sure they're completely cleaned and free of product. If you have products you haven't used yet and they've yet to expire, consider donating them to a local shelter instead of throwing them out. Did you know? Some skincare and cosmetic companies will happily accept your old empties and sometimes even give you a little freebie. For every six empty MAC containers you return, you can get one free MAC lipstick. At Kiehl's, you get one stamp for every container you return. When you get 10 stamps, you get a free travel size product. At Lush, for every five empty black containers you return, you get a free fresh face mask. Origins apparently accepts any empty container from any brand to be recycled. However, I couldn't find much information on their website about this, so I decided to try it out. So I'm gonna call the Origin store now and find out if they actually will accept old empties in their store, like it says online. Um, hi, I read online that you guys have like a recycling program where you can bring in like old containers from any company and you guys will recycle them. I just wanted to know if that was accurate. Oh, oh my God, okay. <laughs> wow, that's okay, thank you. Wow, shocking information. So they still have the program in every single state except for California. So if you're in any other state in the US, <laughs> You can recycle old containers by sending them to Origins or bringing them to an Origins store, uh, except for California, I guess. <laughs> if that doesn't work for you, then there is one more option. Garnier has a partnership with TerraCycle that allows you to send in many types of empty personal hair and beauty containers to be recycled. And if your box is more than 10 pounds, you can get TerraCycle points, which you can redeem for, a wolf, for rewards. For rewards. I get it. Tossing your old empties away is the easiest option. I mean, the trash can is right there. But a little of your time and a swish of water can have a lasting positive effect on our planet. Hey, Unsolved is on a new channel, and now your part. Subscribe, Subscribe here. here. That was my part.